wow, look at these women. They survived all this. So we hear so many stories about girls being taken away, being kidnapped. Everybody knows it's happening, and nobody's doing anything. These women are coming from war-torn countries. I had been running my whole life. I felt this incredible shame. I want my innocent back. Rape and violence against women. Can they ever put their lives back together again? I really want to do something, however small. I invite the women I've interviewed into a theatre workshop. When I met first Rose and she said, we're going to make a play, I am nervous. I am not an actor. This is my story. My life hurts me. Why am I doing this? Why am I hurting myself? Trauma can be re-triggered when you least expect it. I'm scared. It's about emotions and physical sensations. Maybe it's all too much and I shouldn't be opening all this up. Am I mad trying to do this? What I believe we're doing now is to help other women that have gone through the same. It's so important. It's not about me anymore. Yes, I can stand and tell it now. Give them a warm welcome, ladies and gentlemen. You're so beautiful, baby. I met one of the men who abused me when I went back to Eritrea and the airport. The Balkan Hills ladies are definitely a hit. <laughs> Each time I feel like I'm being healed. To see how much it's transformed, that's the most rewarding thing. If you make somebody live their life without fear, that's priceless. And you don't know, we might go to Hollywood and we'll be sitting next to Angelina Jolie. <laughs>